Hey girls, welcome in. I am going to do a quick tutorial today on how to use eyeshadow when you have hooded eyelids. Now, in case you don't know what that is, basically what they're saying is that they don't have a lot of eyelid. They don't have a lot of skin that actually shows when their eye is open. A lot of people have uh, a very deep crease in the eyelid so that a lot of the skin is folded back and you don't see very much eyelid, especially here, you're seeing mostly up here. And it is very hard to put eyeshadow on. I had a friend say, unless I put it clear up here, I don't, I don't know how to do it, I don't know how you're gonna see it. And there are a few tricks that you can use. So I have already done this eye, I'm gonna show you real quick on this eye. You're gonna start with your lightest color. I'm using business-like liquid eyeshadow in a very pale pink. And I'm gonna put that all over my eyelid. This is gonna be my transition base color. Okay, I would do that normally probably with a lot of um, eye looks that I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fan that out. Now here's the biggest difference you're gonna notice. When I go to, first of all, when I go to do my liner, I'm gonna use a really small eyeliner brush and I'm gonna use this really super dark plum color. When I put the eyeliner on, I am only going to use, let me grab a mirror here, I'm only going to use it from right here, about two thirds of the way in my eye to the outer corner. I'm not gonna put liner on this inner corner because that is going to make your eye look smaller. And with hooded eyes, you wanna make your eye look bigger. So I'm only gonna put liner this far. I have no liner on my upper lid. If you're going to wear a liner on your upper lid and you have hooded eyes, make that line as thin as possible. Otherwise, it's taking up precious real estate on your eyelid that you really don't have a lot of room for. And a lot of times, if you wear liner on both the bottom and top, again, it's gonna close your eye in and make it look even smaller. Gals with hooded eyes wanna make their eyes look bigger. So that's the first thing. Next, the next biggest change you're gonna see, I'm going to use um, this mauve tone. They're both mauve tones, but this one's sort of my medium tone. This is gonna be my dark tone. I'm gonna to take that medium tone and I'm gonna take an eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna dip into that color and I'm going to go right here above my natural crease, right about there, okay? And I'm going to put that color along that, above my natural crease and I'm going to go up with that color. So it's a little higher than normal. It's right above my natural crease, okay? Then I'm gonna take a nice thick stubby brush. Sorry, I've got too many brushes here. And I'm going to put that darkest color on my outer eye. And I'm gonna put it right here and just slightly towards the bottom right there. So again, up here and slightly there. Notice my lightest color is gonna be in here. This is all you're seeing is the light pink, the business-like. The darker color is gonna be up here and right at the edge. Now I'm gonna go back and blend that really well. Okay. Blend that out. It's a little too dark right there. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead with my, oh wait, one more step. I'm gonna use this champagne gold color and I'm gonna pop that right here on my inner eyelid. Just a tiny bit of that right there on my inner eyelid to sort of perk that up a little bit. Again, blend that out. Because that's gonna make your eyelid look bigger. All right, now I'm gonna prime my lashes with my primer. I've already used the new Twisted Epic on my lower lashes. Because that's the new one that has the double wand. And then I'm gonna use the fat wand on my top lashes. I love to use this before I use the 4D because it really separates those lashes and gives them a good first coat that really lengthens. The 4D I find gives you thicker because it's got the fibers built in. 
but this gives you a great first coat to get that length going. Then I'm gonna follow up with my 4D on my upper lashes to really add that wow factor. Those fibers will plump my lashes up and make them look as thick as possible. All right, and there we go. So there is your hooded eye look. So I hope that helps a little bit. If you have any more questions or you want me to do a one-on-one -on -one tutorial for you, if you wanna get with me and have me do it on you in person and show you, I'll be glad to do that. But those are my tips to get started. All right, thanks for joining me, friends. Bye-bye.